An initiative to raise funds for St. Joseph's uh, Convent Port of Spain, Covenant for Convent, a fundraising initiative was launched at the Abercrombie Tea House. It's a deed agreement designed to help persons donate funds to help improve the operations of the school. The institution recently celebrated its 181st anniversary and through the efforts of the Past Pupils Association, the new initiative is designed to the school's annual operating cost. Janine Brown reports. The annual operating cost for St. Joseph's Convent Port of Spain is $1 million. To help meet this figure and further improve the school's facilities, the Past Pupils Association birthed the idea of opening an avenue for the public and persons dedicated to the school to give back. Former CEO of the Trinidad Chamber of Industry and Commerce, Catherine Kumar, praised the school for its business venture. An SJC alumni herself, she said in tough economic times like these, institutions cannot depend solely on government for funding. What has worked in the past will not continue to work for the future. It requires new thought, it requires new ideas and creativity. Given the tough economic times, what a great move and such innovation in developing the Covenant with Convent product. This is Elizabeth Crouch. Former principal of the school, Mrs. Elizabeth Crouch, said they also need to make better use of their resources. She made a reference to the property on Oxford Street, which functions as a car park. And at the time when we paid three hundred thousand dollars for that property the plan had been to put something there and so that is now about more than 30 years now and there's nothing there and i throw it out to the people behind this that we shouldn't just say that's a problem you, know? you have to think big and i'm very aware that the school i mentioned in the first instance not prima girls have bitten the bullet and done some incredible things down in their compound and the first to make a pledge for the day was mayor of the capital city, Mr. Joel Martinez. The deed has been approved by the Board of Inland Revenue and donors may also qualify for tax deductions based on their income levels. Interested persons can also visit the SJC Port of Spain Facebook page to make their pledge. In chorus loud and clear, Janine Brown, C News.